Hey everybody, this is Brett with Summit Auto and it is the Monday morning lot walk, July 31st, 2023 edition. We got a ton of stuff in over the weekend, uh, buys and trades and all different stuff, SUVs, cars, trucks. So uh, gonna go over all that stuff. I got the deal of the day, the day right behind me. Uh, really, really nice Ford Focus there. Uh, so let's get right to it. Hope everybody's gonna finish strong this month. And uh, just as a reminder, all these vehicles will be linked in the description below on our website, and we'll be having pictures and descriptions up uh, probably by the end of tomorrow. So anyways, let's get right to it and uh, finish strong for July. Starting off, we got a 2018 Ford Focus four-door SEL. It's got cloth seats, power sunroof, uh, really nice condition, and uh, I think it's like hot chili peppers, the color or something. Anyways, this one's got 91,000 miles on it. It's a 2018. I actually drove this car a little bit on Friday. It is a really nice driving car for 91,000 miles. Uh, feels like it's brand new and it rides really nice as well. So that's my deal of the day. Uh, it's gonna be priced really reasonably. So that's the one to get, especially with gas prices at the second. Anyways, I got a 2016 Lexus 460. And this one's got 92,000 miles on it. It's nicely loaded up and uh, in really nice condition. I think this was a two vehicle trade. Um, it's got the tow package, 92,000 miles, and uh, that'll be a nice uh, luxury budget SUV for somebody. Right here I've got a 2022 Ford F350 Crew Cab Long Box Single Rear Wheel. This is the XL package. This one has, I want to say, 19,000 miles on it. We are going to have to fix that headlight. Uh, but other than that, it's in pretty nice condition. Um, single rear wheel, like I said. Yep, 19,000 miles on this one. And that color is going to be... That's not magnetic gray, that is carbonized gray. I have a 2021 Ram 2500 Tradesman Edition. This one only has 17,000 miles on it. Really clean trade-in right here. Um, that'll be a nice unit for somebody, I think. That one's got the Hemi in it. Somebody traded it in for a diesel. This is a 2022 Laramie Night Edition. This is a Cummins diesel as well, Delmonico Red, nicely loaded up, only 2,000 miles on that truck. Uh, really a nice ride, you get all the blacked out wheels and grill, and uh, that'll be up on our website in a little bit. This is already up on our website, this is a Nissan Altima, this, is, this could be the deal of the day too. Really nice condition, it's high miles, like 90,000 miles on it. Uh, this is a 2500 Ram we took in trade. Uh, this just got through our shop. We just priced it today. I think it's priced at $60,999. Uh, I think it's got 70,000 miles or something on it. Uh, but it's in really nice condition. A couple little dings we got to take care of, but that's no biggie. Uh, here is a 2017 Jeep Wrangler Smoky Mountain Edition. You do not see these very often. Uh, this is a trade-in. has the LED light group. You get the special... Uh, power dome bulge on the hood there uh, that Jeep likes to brag about. Anyways, granite crystals the color. This one comes with a really cool uh, clear see-through top. I forget the name brand on this top, but it's it's really neat. It's actually you can see right through it. A little bright. We do have the original um, original pieces for the hard top in the back, so they do come with that, but like I said, this is a 2017, and the miles on it are 79,000 miles. This one's got leather, heated seats, all loaded up, tow package, uh, color match fenders, color match hardtop. This will be a hot unit. I'm surprised it's not sold already, except that it only came in on Friday night. This is a Jeep Renegade. This is a 2017 Latitude 4x4. It's got 102,000 miles on it. Really nice condition, though, for 102,000 miles. This was a trade-in as well on a brand new Jeep. So that'll be a hot ride. Probably really well priced. This is a 2018 Ram 2500. I believe this is a Laramie as well. This one has the Cummins diesel. 
and it is also a night edition so you get the blacked out wheels and the painted bumpers it could be a sport edition actually i think it's probably a sport since it says since it has the color match grill so that's a really nice ride really clean as well 24,000 miles on that truck here is a 2019 or 18 pacifica this one's got 92,000 miles on it and uh this one is red velvet pearl coat or no i'm sorry what does chrysler call that octane red i don't know i think it's red velvet pearl coat anyway same paint code as delmonico red but this one's got 92,000 miles it's a limited it's in really nice condition and uh, we just got that in on trade as well this is a purchase we purchased this 2020 chevy suburban lt this one's got 59,000 miles i think this color is called satin steel metallic really a good looking color uh, one of my favorite colors on the gm vehicles get the chrome trim grill uh, it has the smaller wheels so replacing tires is not as expensive uh, that's a really nice ride it's got quads dual dvd this is a 2016 Chevy Silverado 2500 Duramax, and this is a crew cab short box. This is a high country, and we just got this one in. Really nice condition. It's got dual DVD in the headrests as well. The only thing we got to do to that is uh, the rear bumper needs to be fixed up a little bit, but other than that, really nice. Here is the second trade from that double deal that we did on Saturday. This is a 2016, I want to say, Cadillac Escalade. Yes, 2016. This one has 116,000 miles, believe it or not. Uh, really, really nice condition on this for 116,000 miles. And uh, yeah, you can see our sales guy left the license plate border in the windshield, so that's great. Anyways, uh, we're going to have all these booked in, processed descriptions online in just a little bit and look what just showed up this is a gold rush challenger uh, this is new just came in don't even know the year in fact when I started this video I don't even think this was out here and now it's here so let's take a look see how many miles are on it 11,000 miles and this is a you can always tell the year 921 this is a 2021 so gold rush one of my favorite colors on the challengers uh, this is only the second one i've ever seen actually third one i've seen in person and uh it's only the second one we've ever had on our lot really a cool color it was originally a special color for the uh, 50th anniversary challenger and this one is a 21 so They've kept it around for special editions, I guess. Anyways, those are all the new vehicles that we got in over the weekend. Uh, we did get a couple of ones on Friday and Thursday that are already processed over there. Uh, so just check our website out. Once again, all this stuff's going to be linked in the bottom. This is a Ram 3500 ICE in 2017 I just videoed on Friday. That's a Bighorn Level 2 Eco Diesel that I videoed on Friday. I still got to do the video on this Wagoneer L, so that's, um, that's on my list of things to do. This is a Challenger we just got through for pictures. That'll be getting a video hopefully later today. This is a high mileage Challenger. I think it's got 60,000 miles on it. Uh, it's a 392, like a 2012. Uh, really nice condition for the miles. And then there are finance managers vehicles. They like to park in our booking area and uh, whatever. Anyways, go check us out. Everybody finish strong at the end of the month here in July. And it looks like we'll be nicely stocked for August. And hopefully we have a good month then because we didn't this month. So everybody have a great day and uh, finish strong.